What's up, y'all? Welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Rose. If you're new here, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. And today is Saturday. I'm about to get ready to go to a birthday dinner at Agave Azul on um, Kirkman in Orlando. I am a little bit under the weather, so excuse me, y'all. I have an upper respiratory infection. Um, I tested negative for COVID, negative for the two strains of flu that they have going on out here. But y'all, when I told y'all I lost my voice, I lost my voice. So I'm about to get ready and do my makeup. I'm currently watching Leslie's vlog. She just posted a vlog. And um, I'm about to do my makeup. And I'm going to take y'all with me to the restaurant. And we're going to see what we get into. But... Tomorrow, I'm also going out for my aunt and my cousin's birthday to Cheddar's. So, we have a little bit of stuff to get done. Today, I went to get my laser appointment. I get my underarms lasered, my full legs, my Brazilian, the strip in the back. I also get my stomach lasered. And what else? Yeah, that's pretty much it. So, my underarms, my stomach, my Brazilian, my butt. The butt strip and my full legs so i get all of that laser but i don't do it all at the same time i get different packages and as the packages stop i get like another one and start the other package so right now i'm doing brazilian oh and i'm doing my chin as well y'all y'all remember i had like um really bad ingrown hairs right here but now it's pretty much gone and my skin is clearing up I do microneedling once a month. I try to do it like every four to six weeks and it has been helping so much with my pores, my dark spots, my basically my skin complexion. It's been helping so much. I still have some dark spots right here and a little bit of acne scars but so far my new skincare routine has been doing the thing so I'm about to do my makeup and then tomorrow I also want to record a favorites for September and October. So I'm going to do that tomorrow and I have a lymphatic drainage massage on Tuesday and a dentist appointment on Tuesday and then it's Thanksgiving the following week. Today is the 18th of November so let me do my makeup and then I'll see y'all when I'm going to the restaurant. All right, y'all, so I just wanted to show y'all what I've been using on my skin. Um, so I've been using this Panoxyl Acne Cream Wash 4% benzoyl peroxide mixed with this dial. I got this concoction from Kyra on YouTube, and this has been a game changer for my skin. I use it once a week together, and then I also use them separately. When I'm ovulating, I use this... Um, more because that's when I tend to break out and the days that I work out and I'm sweating a lot I just wash my face with the Dow soap and then in the morning every morning I use this um, Cos RX low pH good morning gel cleanser this is a clean botanical brand and I love this cleanser it has tea tree oil in it so it helps to fight inflammation and also to clear up my skin. And then at night, I use the Tatcha Deep Cleanse. I love Tatcha's products. I don't know what they put in there, but Tatcha is the only high-end skincare brand that clears up my skin and also helps it look really nice. This also has beads in it, which is going to help exfoliate your skin, but it's not harsh. To double cleanse at night, I use this um, Claire's Gentle Black Deep Cleansing Oil. And basically, when you mix it with water, it turns into this milky consistency, which helps to remove sunscreen, impurities, dirt, and also traces of makeup. But I never tried it as a makeup remover on its own. And then as a toner, I've been... I went back to using my Ole Hendrickson Balance and Force Oil Control Toner. This feels so good. It has AHAs and BHAs in it, which is going to help kill that acne on your face and also repair your skin texture, any bumps or anything like that that you have on your skin. And it helps to balance out your oils. 
And then as an essence, um, I've been using this Beauty of Joseon Ginseng Essence Water to help enhance the skincare products that I'm going to put after. As a, another essence that I've been really loving is this Advanced Snail Mucin Power Essence. This has helped make my skin so hydrated, so soft. It has helped lighten my dark spots over time and also it provides great hydration to my skin. And every morning I just use this as a moisturizer, the Garnier Vitamin C with SPF. This is a 3-in-1 serum. It acts as a moisturizer and SPF and a serum all in one. So this is what I've been using during the daytime. I love it. It's lightweight. It does smell like pineapples, which I'm not a fan of, but it works. And then as a nighttime treatment cream, I've been using the Proven Skincare. This is a custom skincare um, brand that makes skincare based off of your environment, your skin. You take a quiz and then they formulate the products using AI technology. So I've been using this. I'm not a fan of the smell. It's pretty pricey, but it works so well. It has Grand Active Retinol in it, which is a lot more gentle than tretinoin so I don't really peel when I use this so I love it and then for exfoliating I've been using this first aid beauty facial radiance pad it has lactic acid and glycolic acid in it which is going to help brighten your skin um, help with skin texture and also if you have any acne I use this once every other day so about three times a week and it's super soft, gentle, this brand is clean, and I love their products. And then for face mask, I use this Innocence Free Pore Clearing Clay Mask for my pores, and this um, Teamy Beauty Mask. So that's pretty much all the products that I've been using on my skin, and they've been working. Alright y'all, so I just finished um, my makeup. And I'm just laying down in the bed right now. I'm so tired. Last night, I had a night, baby. I had a night. My friend had a girl's night. And we were playing Risha Roulette. And, baby, the amount of shots I had to take. Because the game is like, literally, take a shot if you did this. Take a shot if you do this. If you don't want to do this, take three shots. So, we was taking shots of um, tequila reposado and baby when I tell you I, I was still hung over this morning but um, getting ready to put my outfit on so I can go it is 743 and we have to be there at 830 she said and it's about 40 minutes away from me so with this traffic in Orlando it's like freaking California Cali times two but yeah I'm about to get ready my makeup is done I did eyeshadow. I told y'all I'm starting to get back into doing eyeshadow. And yeah. Anyways, I'm about to get ready and head over there. Alright y'all, so I'm dressed. Um, I'm going to be taking this bag with me. I have on this long dress from Misguided. It's like a long dress. I have my necklace from Forever 21. My jewelry is from Allure Anytime. This is their tennis bracelet and the bangle. And then for perfume, I'm going to be wearing Onyx by Rebel Sense mixed with Prada La Femme. And I love this. This is like my all-time favorite perfume of all times, okay? That mixed with. Divine combo. Purr. All right.
Target, my cousin got it for me for my birthday. Super comfortable. Stars above. The best pajama brand. But I'm about to take my makeup off with this soft um, makeup eraser wipe. What it's called? Makeup eraser wipe. This has changed the game for me. Like, it removes all of my makeup. And I've been using the Pond's Cold Cream makeup remover to take my makeup off I don't like how it feels it has like a film a nasty film after but it does the job at removing the makeup it's like a cream it's a cream it's like a like a cream a deep cleanse Need to give myself a deep cleanse. Uh, I use like a pretty good amount. And then I just rub it up. Oh. Rub the saddle shots. Yeah. The food was so good. We had so much food. Um, I had a burrito. The burrito was good. Oh, I feel like when I use like just like an oil balm, I always end up with makeup on my hairline. But with this makeup remover thing, thingy majigger, I can get my hairline. Cause y'all see all the makeup on my hairline. I feel like I can get it, but I'm ready for bed. Oh. Man, I'm ready for that. Ah, look at this nasty. But it really does take off all my makeup. Make sure I get everything. I'm so tired, me ask.
Good morning. Well, it's not morning. It's like 12, honey. Well, 1. And I'm supposed to be going out at like 4, 5-ish. But I just want to show you all what I got from the Sephora sale. I've been shopping a little bit um, from different places. And we're going to start off with the Sephora sale. I picked up a refill of the Fenty Hydro Visor. This one for the winter time. I only use this SPF moisturizer in the winter time because during the summer it is so greasy y'all. Like it is super super greasy and oily. But during the winter time, fire. And then I also picked up a mini of their Cookies and Clean Detox Face Mask. I have used this baby up already and I love it. It helps to really detoxify your skin and it leaves it pretty soft. So, a must. And it's fragrance free. I picked up a real beauty blender. I've been using the little janky beauty blenders from like the stores. And this one came with a beauty blender and a little cleansing solid for you to clean your beauty blender with. So, I don't really use beauty blenders like that. I most likely use bl brushes because I feel like beauty blenders soak up a lot of the product and it gives you more like a sheared look as opposed to like when you use a brush, I feel like you get more full coverage. So I picked up a beauty blender. I picked up the St. Bart's Way Body Cream. This smells like a tropical island. I love it so much. It smells so, so good. Like a vacation in a bottle. It smells like a fruit salad, tropical fruit salad. So I picked up the body cream. And I also picked up the Pharrell Youth Junkie Intensive Renewal Collagen Infused Mask. Y'all know I have the Pharrell Mini and I love it so much. It's basically like an advanced skincare device that helps to penetrate these serum masks into your skin. It gives your skin such a glow. This leaves your skin so soft. I love the Call It A Night and the H2O mask. Those are so good. But I love my Pharrell. Been using it for a while. Um, so I picked that up. And then from... So XO, I picked up their body wash, the Erotica Gel. This is a aromatherapy body wash. It is made with natural ingredients. It's a clean brand. Y'all know I love their um, bar soaps and the Erotica bar soaps for your um, vaginal health. So good, but I picked up the body wash. It smells very, very therapeutic. And it's supposed to get you and your partner going, like the smell. But I pretty much love it for the aromatherapy benefits. It's natural and clean ingredients. And then from Ulta, I picked up a Sun Bum Body Spray, the sunscreen. Y'all know this is my favorite sunscreen brand. I picked up the body spray for when I go on my walks. Um, I just spray my body with the sunscreen as opposed to the cream. And I also picked up... Lately, for my hair, I've been loving what you would call it, Paul Mitchell. So, I re-upped on my favorite shampoo from them, which is the Shampoo One. This is an everyday wash, balance clean. This really cleans your scalp. It also helps if you have, like, medium to fine hair. It's for chemically treated hair. It basically helps it to be more manageable, shiny, and clean. And then I picked up the Detangler. This is the original conditioner, super rich. This, if you have tangled, matted up hair, this will definitely detangle your hair. It will leave it so soft. The slip is immaculate. And it won't leave like a nasty like silicone film on your hair. It just leaves your hair so soft but not filmy. So these two is what I've been using a lot on my hair lately, Paul Mitchell. And then I also picked up a lip oil from e.l.f., just a basic lip oil. And then from Target, I picked up this different gel, Adapalene gel. This is an acne treatment. It's a 
One's Daily Topical Retinoid. I primarily pick this up for when I travel so that I don't have to bring my huge, like, Creology thing. So, I picked this one up. I haven't used it yet, but it's just like a backup. And then I picked up another one of my favorite candles. This is from Just Be Candle. This is their Cocoa Butter Cashmere. This smells like sweet cocoa butter with coconut and jasmine and it has like a little warm scent her candles are so clean they burn clean they burn all the way down your room will be smelling good the entire house will be smelling good you could smell it on your towels your clothes i just love her candles so much and just me candles and then from micah's i just picked up like three long sleeve like sheer shirts this is my first time shopping at micah's so i picked up three colors and the white and the white one came with the dang on stain on it and i emailed them about it and they were asking me to send pictures and all of this and i did and i have never heard back from them so customer service negative and then my friend gifted me this la mer set and it has a bunch of little minis in it. This is very bougie skincare, but it came with the treatment lotion, their iconic famous creme de la mer moisturizing cream. I have two of them, actually, two. Um, and then it has a bigger bottle of the treatment lotion. It also has the emotion the hydrating infused emotion it also has the eye cream it came with a cleansing foam as well and also a renewing oil and i've used this one before and it makes your face so soft so hydrated but these are two different mini sets that was purchased so I'm so excited to use this. I'm not going to use this every day, y'all. This is bougie stuff, okay? This is that pricey stuff. It's that stuff that I'm just going to savor and use. So, yeah. I'll see y'all later. All right, y'all. So, I just finished getting ready to head to Cheddar's. And all I have on is this black bodysuit, these cargo black pants. And I wore the necklace from Forever 21. And then I have on the Danessa Myricks Yummy Skin on my face. I just finished recording my favorites, so that's in there. And then I have on this gloss from Ulta. This is like my favorite gloss right now. It's shiny, it's sheer, it's pinky, and it has sparkles in it. And it leaves your, your face, I mean your face, your lips so moisturized and hydrated and very kissable. Alright, so... I'll see y'all when I get to the restaurant. I don't even know what I'm going to eat, y'all. I'll be looking at the menu. Who looks at the menu for restaurants before they go? Because I know I do. And I do that because I want to know what I'm getting myself into and what I would want to order or want to eat. So I'm thinking I'm probably going to get, like, ribs. Um, that's what I'm thinking. But I don't know. The food better be good. I ate there before one time, but I can't really remember if the food was popping. I'll probably give it like a 5 out of 10 from last time. Like, it's called Cheddar's. But, let's go. Y'all, here's a better look at the fit. It's just a black bodysuit and these black cargo pants. Okay. Everything. Okay. Okay. But let me see what perfume I'm going to wear, y'all. I don't know. What perfume? Oh, I'm going to wear this uh, sample of the Replica Matcha Meditation. I wore this the other day and baby, it smells so good. It smells just like matcha, but like a, it dries down to a sweet, whew, a sweet matcha. Oh my God, it smells so good. I want to get the bigger bottle, but it, when you first spray it, it's a fresh citrusy lime matcha but then it dries down to like a nice vanilla matcha scent but but it smells just like matcha so if you're not a fan of matcha you may not like this but 
I love it. it. Smells amazing. I'm gonna get a bigger bottle, but it's been sold out. The smaller version of it is sold out because the big one is there, but the smaller version is definitely sold out. So I don't know, but I love that. And I also got um, a scent bird. My my scent bird for October was um, Perfumes de Marley Valet. And this one, Perfumes de Marley Valet. This is part of their Saks collection and it came with a case. So I think every time you get a Saks collection, they give you a case with it. But this smells divine, okay? Divine. Divine. Let me get the notes. What notes is in there? This is the October one that I got. And the notes are bergamot, white peach, orange blossom, vanilla, and musk. And it smells so good. It smells like very woody, floral, musky. And this is my October one. Y'all know I've been obsessed with these little travel micro perfumes. So, yeah. Let me put my shoes on. I'm just going to put on my Nikes. I want to get some Dunks. Um, I want to get like white and black ducks. My best friend had them on when we went to DC and I was messed up with it. So, see y'all at the restaurant. <laughs> We got butter for sauce right here. Good morning, y'all. So I just left my lymphatic drainage massage. I'm about to go to Einstein Bros and get me a bagel because I am hungry. But it was so nice in there. The lady was so gentle. I got a lymphatic drainage regular. Anybody can get a lymphatic drainage massage. It just essentially helps with um, bloating, excess water weight, gets your circulatory system moving, helps you use the bathroom. It makes your body so soft. It makes your stomach so, so soft and basically like airy instead of like hard as a rock. This lighting is so bad because I'm parked like in the shade, but here we are. So, oh my God, this lighting is so bad. Okay, yeah. So I'm about to go and get a bagel and then I'm gonna head for a walk. So I'll see y'all later. Bagel secured. Um, I think I'm gonna make a stop at Trader Joe's. Um, they got this sunscreen 
at Trader Joe's that's supposed to be a dupe for the unseen sunscreen, which doesn't leave a white cast um, on your face. So we're going to see. God damn. <clears throat> they put so much cream cheese on here. My Lord. But it's good though. Mm. But Lord, they put a lot of cream cheese. Like, golly. Oh my God. But it's so good. All right. I secured the bag. So, this is the sunscreen. It was $7. This is what it looks like it's a daily facial sunscreen, broad SPF. 40 oil free and it's an invisible gel and then i also got some waters these little um sparkling juices i got some chomps turkey and then i heard everybody talking about this brand right here this brazilian nut body trio they didn't have just the body butter but it's supposed to smell like the Sol de Janeiro Boom Boom Cream. So this set was $12. It came with a body oil, a body mist, and a body butter. So I picked it up. Now we're out. It's so hot, dog. So hot. So y'all, this smells exactly like the Sol de Janeiro Boom Boom Cream. But it, the scent doesn't last as long as about three hours. This body mist, trash, garbage. This body oil mixed with the body butter, amazing. You'll get quality moisture, but the scent don't last about three hours, like I said, on me. So if you want the dupe, you can get it, but I would not be too hype to pick it up. But my favorite out of the three is the body oil, which they don't sell by itself. But like I said, when you mix the body oil with the body butter, then you get moisture so i had to mix this body butter with another lotion to get the moisture so it's up to you all right y'all thanksgiving hitting up we got the turkey green bean casserole we got the ham pineapple upside down my aunt said this dessert this i don't know what kind of dessert this is and she said this dessert too. This is a uh, peppermint candy. Okay. This the appetizer. We got the fruit. My cousin just made some devil eggs. Period. Okay, ma'am. We got crackers. We got um, what is it? Pinwheels. Chips. Fritos, cheese. What else they got? What else they got? What else they got? I think both are mashed potatoes. This mashed potatoes? I thought this was corn casserole. Okay, done. This mashed potatoes. We got corn casserole. We got du jonjon with shrimp. We got some potatoes. Potatoes. What else we got? Okay, this is more rice. This is <laughs> mac and cheese. Mac and cheese. Yeah. Then we got the table set up over there with the little the children. Huh? Esther been on this thing a thousand times. They don't see Esther a million times. Unintentionally and intentionally. They was crack they was cracking up when you was eating that seafood boy out of the microwave at two o'clock in the morning, yo. <laughs> it was like, who eat a seafood boy at two AM? My cousin. My aunt said she made this uh cranberry sauce from scratch. And then we got gravy. Yeah, she did. Here he is. Well my friend. We got Moscato. And then she gave me food, and then that was like a... My cousin hit him, boy! Ooh! Say Grace. Say Grace. She said the Grace, too. We so watched it, Paul Express. Her. We got a little table set up. I'm almost done with my meal. But I'm about to get seconds, so...